Hey, we're going for round two. I'm here with Blackman, the traveler. What's going on? I'm uh, a Man United fan. <laughs> and I'm outside enemy territory. What is it like to come to here to Anfield? Like, what is it like? There's so much passion, you know. There's people who come from all around the world. Yeah. And also a lot of Liverpoolians. So there's like 60,000 odd people in the stadium. Yeah, people from all over the world, including locals. There's no way we can get in. We've got to pay. Hey, uh, yeah. We can break in, yeah. <laughs> Black man, the traveler. And Zach Jones breaking yeah. in into Enfield, yeah. It's the yeah. entrance right there. Oh, that's the entrance? Yeah. Hello, my mate. How you doing? Oh, hello. You right? Yeah, cool. Yeah, you, you watch the YouTube or? Yeah, seen it today on YouTube, cool. That mud popped down, on it? Yeah. Yeah. You said it's man. That was crazy, that wasn't it? Yeah. What do you feel? The perception of Liverpoolians and Scousers are, is. Around here, yeah. around here. <laughs> can't beat that, can you? And it's just YouTube you saw my content on? Yeah, yeah. Alright, so. I like, do TikTok, I'm, I'm, I'm too old for all that. Yeah, to people who have never been to Liverpool before, why would you recommend coming? Obviously, you've got the football. The football, it's the whole, there's loads of things to see in the city centre, isn't it? You've got to spend a week here, haven't you? Yeah. At least. Yeah. What's your name again, man? Frank. Frank, nice to meet you, man. Nice one, Zach. Appreciate it. Have a good day, I'm here. You take care, man. I'm Blackman the Traveller, that's my name on YouTube. And that's uh, Zach Jones. Hi, uh, nice to meet you. Where are you from? Bermuda. Oh. First of all, what beaches in the UK? Bermuda's expensive as fuck. Um, Her was way, way cheaper. How long have you been in the UK for? Four years for me. Four years? Oh, I'm gonna ask you a question. What is it like to be a colored person to live in Liverpool? What are your experiences being there? I was told that it was very racist. Like yeah. everyone, I lived in Nottingham before this and everyone, like even taxi drivers, as soon as I said that I was moving to Liverpool, they're like, you know, it's very racist. Yeah. I love over here. Like I really think that it's like the most friendly part of England that I've ever been in. My yeah. neighbors speak. When, yeah. I, when I came, they was like, you know, if you need a cup of sugar, you can knock on my door. <laughs> my neighbors in Nottingham, literally, they will look you in your face and not speak to you. Not to say that there is no part that is yeah, you know, yeah. I, I just have not experienced it. I think that everyone's very, very friendly. Okay, what's Bermuda like? It's beautiful. You like come hot weather all the yeah. year on up until January. It's hot, you know. Yeah. Really hot, like this time heat wave warm. hot. You know when you guys okay. were suffering the other yeah, day? Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. what we experience every day. That's okay. In the summertime. I can handle the heat. I can handle the heat. I can. People are friendly. It's a tourism place, so you do yeah. get that. Hi, hi, hi. You know, and I'm not used to that. Like it's a beautiful country. It's just very expensive. So if you go there, please. Yeah. Have your budget ready for uh, spend ready. like are you ready? 20, I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> one last question, yeah. <laughs> Not you two colours, you have to pick one. Blue or red in Liverpool. Everton or Liverpool? No, Liverpool. Hey, Manchester you know United. Yeah! Yes! No way! <laughs> right guys, we've got a Man United right. supporter. No, no, he's walking away because he's just... We've got a Man United supporter in the building. No. I'm Liverpool. Yeah, Why well. Man United? And I just because I just like it. See, see, <laughs> we gotta be, we gotta be very careful because right now we're enemy territory. Yeah. I have to say this on camera. I am for Liverpool mainly because my dad was born in Liverpool. Okay. So I am yeah. blood of Liverpool. Even yeah. though I'm from Bermuda, so it's a small country as you see. Yeah. I was born in Bermuda. My dad was born here, and this is where I live now. He passed away last year, so yeah. I keep on Liverpool the name. Always, that, that's for life. Aww. What was his name? You got to change clubs. Mark. Mark. You got to change clubs. <laughs> well, I'm gonna give you. I've got a business card, yeah. so you can scan my YouTube channel. I just registered my business yesterday, so you got to look out for some of the cold tribe right. on you there. Right there. Food. Scan that QR code to my YouTube channel. That's my Instagram, and I follow you straight back. Yeah, sure. Um, what do you want to shout food, out? Food. This girl who cooked some. What's the Instagram Bermuda page? Food. I haven't did it yet, but Nine. look out for yeah. tribe Bermuda. It should be there tribe soon. Room. What's Bermuda food like? You're gonna try it. I'm yeah. going to call you when fish. I do. Yeah. Yeah. So you can fish. have some fish oh, yeah. sandwiches oh, and you know some macaroni and cheese, some Thank barbecue you. chicken. Yeah. We've got you potato salad, salad yeah. coleslaw, all of that. Spanish rice. Oh, you, you guys are great. Spanish rice. Oh, Take care. Oh, Enjoy your Take care. Scan the QR code. That's a YouTube channel. And the app Blackman the Traveler. That's the Instagram. Thank you very much. What are you doing here? Uh, just making some burritos. Oh yeah. What's the best burrito you make here? Brisket probably. What's so famous about this area? Like, what is this? What is this place? Um, it's just a food market with um, six different stalls, Cuban, seafood. Look how nice that looks. Uh, what are you making here? Gambas, people. Where does Pimbel originate from? From Asia, is it? Yeah. Yeah. from Asia. Say again. Gambas from Asia. No, so. Argentina. Oh, Argentina. Oh, Argentina. In Argentina, lad, what's the food like? Argentina, I've got some amazing food. Empanadas is like a yeah, pastry, yeah. right? Yeah. It's like Jamaican pastry in Argentina. Hello. See me on YouTube. 
Yeah. Right here, the flesh, bro. I'm in Liverpool, yeah? What's so good about Liverpool, my brother? You wanna jump on camera? What's so good about Liverpool? I'm actually filming, but he's filming right now. Good, man, just drive people along. Yeah. Liverpool, how would you describe Liverpool? How would you describe it? It's a nice city, you know. Okay, yeah, okay. People are good. My name's Fred. Fred? Yeah. Hey, bro. Nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I saw you in India, man. Yeah, yeah Zach, nice to meet you, my guy. I hope you enjoyed the videos, my brother. Yeah, I'm doing a good job. Thank yeah. you, thank you. Yeah, take care, Peace and love. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Take, take care, care, brother. Let's come on. Hey, my guy. Yeah. Interesting. Recognising Liverpool, yeah. you know, hey. That's what I was saying in Argentina. The food in Argentina, so they've got empanadas. Yeah. The pastry, yeah? Yeah. And you get all different type right. of um you get oh, all different yeah. type of food. You get um chicken empanadas, you get beef empanadas, you get cheese and onion empanadas. Very tasty. Yeah. I definitely recommend you to visit um Argentina. I've heard the steak want. there is the best. Best steak. Yeah. Best beef I've tried in the world, Argentina. Yeah. Are you camera shy? No. Well actually she's not camera shy, well, can you get again? <laughs> What's your name? Stephanie, my name is Amir, but I go by the name of Black Man the Traveler on YouTube. And I'm Zach Jones, nice yeah, to meet you. Nice to meet you. I want to ask you a question. What's so famous about this area where we're standing right now? What's so famous about it? What's so it? good about it? What's what do you like about it? Um, suppose the people, everyone's dead friendly, everyone's easy going. Is this a pub? No, it's a hairdresser, so we make sure it's open and a hairdresser, so we're in Can I come in? Yeah, yeah. Alright. Oh, this come is, look, this is looking camera. nice already. What? Yeah. Watch the paint. Yeah. This is looking good already, eh? I like the colorway. Nice and pink. Okay, alright. Mm. So this is gonna be uh, a hairdresser, yeah? Hairdressers, yeah. Two York East, L1, 5 pm and it's called Sabella Hair. Best hairdressers yeah. in Liverpool now, yeah? yeah. I'm gonna give you a business card. You can check out my YouTube channel. Right now you're on camera. Scan the QR code, so I can Right guys, I would like to introduce you to Chantel. Hey, nice to finally meet you. Oh my god, it's the famous yeah. black man. Yeah. Hello. Hello, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. My name is Blackman. How are you doing today? Do I just call you Blackman? Blackman. Oh, you can't just call him Blackman. <laughs> no, that's, that's what I... I'm getting the permission to call me Blackman, alright? You can right? call me Filipino. Alright, Filipino woman. Right, Filipino woman. White boy. White boy. So, where are we, Chantal? So, this is where I work. It's yeah. called Rude in Liverpool. It's the largest strip club in the UK. Um, I don't know that. Oh yeah. So what's it like working here in Rude? Um, it's sick to be honest. As yeah. a dancer, it's like the place that you work your way up to. So I started off okay. with a really small club and then I always wanted to end up working here. So I checked Chantelle's profile and saw yeah. she dances, but then she also started her own YouTube channel. Uh, I'd like you to tell my channel about a bit of that. Yeah, so I started making vlogs about being a stripper. Yeah. Um, and now... <laughs> <laughs> and now um, I'm using that platform to promote my music. Yeah. I hope you become a successful woman. Thank um, you. I hope you achieve your goals. It's not hard, especially as a female, to you know achieve certain goals in certain different industries. But you'll be successful. You just got to be, you just got to be consistent. And never with the right people. What's going on? What's going on, guys? Welcome to Bowl Street, which is one of the most popular roads here on Liverpool. Isn't it such a it's nice fine. vibe? Yeah, where's the best place to eat on here? Oh, do you know what? I think it's Lebanese or Moroccan. What's going on, lads? <laughs> There's a spot down there, it's like Moroccan or Lebanese. Oh. Absolutely Come, we should go. Yeah. I think so. Hola, viva Mexico! <laughs> You know what the sick thing about Liverpool is? Everything's close together and when you're drunk, yeah. it's great. Yeah. Whereas in you London, don't get you have lost. to get taxis every day. <laughs> What's the price of living here compared to in London? Oh my god, are you joking? Tell me. Like in London, um, a, when I was a student, a two bedroom flat was um, 1600 a month. Yeah. Here it's a lot cheaper. Have you grown up in Liverpool? Yeah, I have. Yeah. Though I haven't got very much of a strong accent. See, my mother's from Coventry, my father as well. Oh, no way. Yeah, I yeah, got loads of people calling me a wool and they don't believe I'm from here, you know? <laughs> yeah, you have, your accent is quite tight. Yeah. <laughs> Do your best Scouse accent. Alright, what shall I say? Hey, la, welcome to Liverpool. No, I know. Go on. That's heavy, ma. Hey. Do you. That's heavy, though. So what, should I do like a Scouse accent? Yeah, go for yeah. it, lad. Uh, how's it, how's it going? <laughs> ha, 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 
London, Land, is that Ach? No? Fair enough. What's a typical scale somewhere? Heavy. Heavy? That's, that's heavy that? This is Matthew Street, bro. Cash. What's going on, my guy? You got the same job as me now? Uh, well, I'm on the flex one now. Uh, how is it? I'm here. Oh, so there's no parking oh, whatsoever. Is this Kesh from, from Nigeria? <laughs> what do you think about Liverpool, bro? How, how's life selling in here? It's the best city ever. Yeah. Yeah. What are I've, the been here, like? I've been here only. I've been here 11 years. Yeah. And I thought I was going to move somewhere else, but I'm not going to move anywhere. No. I'm just going to stay here. You got your yeah. child now? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I do. Yeah. Congratulations, Thank bro. You very much. Hey, it's a tough job, I know. Yeah. 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 Take it easy, bro. Yeah. Walking past the taxi rank here, yeah. Yeah. and there's a, there's a taxi driver sitting there in the driver's seat playing a guitar. Oh, really? Uh, in the front of myself, a taxi? Where, yeah. where else are you going to see that? Yeah. You know, it is, it's great. And it's a very multicultural city. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I live next door to an Indian boat. Oh, do you? Yeah. 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 Do, you come, do you come here often? Yeah. Do you, is this oh, you can fold. <laughs> <laughs> is this part uh, like the Very one? smooth, Chantal. <laughs> <laughs> is, um, is this part of like everyone's local spot or what? Well, it's in. It's not everyone's local spot because it's in the city centre. Oh. Thank you. I live about 10 minutes away from the city centre on the bus, so it's not yeah. to me, you know. Liverpool's got a right community spirit, hasn't it? It is, yeah. Where are you from? Um, I've just moved from London, but I've moved to Liverpool and I'm loving life. Do you think there are a lot of misrepresentations of Liverpool? It's, there was a riot in 1981. There was a lot of unemployment, which Margaret Thatcher said she was going to quote it. I am going to put Liverpool into a managed decline. In other words, I'm going to bankrupt the Scouse bastards. Yeah. Yeah. But so she appointed Michael Hefferty as the Minister for Merseyside. And he took the job seriously, got stuck in and brought investment. So it's the only decent story there's ever been as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> <laughs> that's fair enough. It's a, it's a big part of the history here in Liverpool and that's yeah. why you know, that's it's a, the manufacturer area. It's a big part of the history here. She wouldn't come in. Yeah. She was scared to come in. Yeah. yeah. She wouldn't have got out. <laughs> and to the young generation in Liverpool, what would your recommendations be to them when growing up? Have you got any advice? I'm not one of the younger generation. <laughs> but, but what advice would you give to them? Stop wearing those Stupid black coats with hoods on <laughs> and stop wearing masks. You're not gangsters, you're children. Mm. You know, I sat next to a kid on the bus the other day. Mask up here, hood up. It was roasting out. Why it was like that? Yeah. But I was talking to me being pastor and pillar to post since it was eight months old. So, and you know better. Yeah. He really didn't. But some of them, and these bastards on the, 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 uh, the trail bikes, yeah. you know, they're doing wheelies down the road. None of them are wearing crash helmets. They're wearing ballet gloves. Putting their life in jeopardy, would you say? But they're putting everyone else's life in jeopardy. Yeah. A few months, last year, I think it was, or earlier this year, a woman was knocked over by a 14 year old riding a stolen one. Killed it. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, my advice would be stop acting like that. Yeah. Yeah, it's a good advice and that's some straightforward elder gentleman advice you don't want to be nice about it you want to make the point it's still good being nice about it yeah people seem nice and sweet yeah and you know what a lot of young guys they need to hear some straight up down to the yeah. down to the yeah. point message, you know. Yeah. You know, you hear some of these fellows who are even older than me. Yeah. Should put them in the army. The yeah. army don't want them. Yeah. <laughs> so that's, that's not a solution. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for sharing that. And you're right with me sharing that on YouTube. You're fine with it. Thank you're you. What's your name again? Graham. Graham. I prefer to be called Craig. Craig. All right. Greg. Nice no, to not Greg. Craig. Craig. Yeah. Craig. Nice to meet you. Thank you very much. Right, we're here outside Ruth, and me and Blackman the Traveller have ultimate access. First guys to enter this strip club in the day. Well, guys, thank you for watching the video. Blackman the Traveller. Hey, he's about to head back into London. He's just missed his train, actually. Uh, this is my train. 
But uh, I was charging my camera on the way to the train station. We pulled into a Romanian road oh. in uh, between Toxduff and Alata on, on Smith Down Road. Unreal energy yeah. that they showed us, great hospitality. Zach even got some free chicken. Oh, yeah, I pulled chicken. up. So if you want to see that, go to Black Man the Travelers. Um, YouTube page. Yeah. He's gonna be putting these videos out in a month because he's black backlogged at the moment. Yeah. But uh, we did really have a good experience there in in the Romanian road. Got some right. free chicken. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Good people. Good energy. It was a bit. It was a bit weird. It was a bit on edge at first. Like I, I felt a little bit on edge at first. But lads, what do you think of Liverpool? Um, out of ten, I would say. I would say eight out of ten. Yeah. It's, very diverse. You haven't experienced it all yet, to no, be fair. I'm not, but I'm definitely going to come back here. Yeah. Um, I want to experience the nightlife. It's very diverse. Uh, very, very cool, very uh, social. From my experience. Uh, it's, it's a big city. People, 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 like you said, it's small. It doesn't seem small. Because they're not compared to London, yeah, but yeah, the thing London. is, London city centre, you can bike around there, but yeah. here, like, we might say it's a smaller city than London, but yeah. we're, we're including every single little area, you know? Yeah. I'll have to come down to your ends in London. What are they like? <laughs> you have to wait and see. Ah, oh, that's a good answer. <laughs> All right, bro. Thank you very much for coming down. Thank you. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.